Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. I made a pretty big announcement on Instagram last week, I think, um, or last weekend. And if you haven't checked it out already, go take a look. But basically, I'm gonna announce it here on YouTube now. I am pregnant again. <laughs> this is my second COVID baby. <laughs> Uh, and I am currently 24 weeks pregnant, almost 24 weeks pregnant. So yeah, it's gone pretty quick this time around. Um, I haven't really had much time to think about it or um, treat it like Daniel's pregnancy. So because Daniel's been so full on and they're so close together. Today, I thought I'd come on here and do a updated makeup routine of how I do it now as a mummy. I feel like it's only gonna get shorter and shorter <laughs> as this new baby comes along. But let's just get into it. I've got maybe, I reckon, like five minutes until Daniel wakes up from his nap and then I've gotta head out. So let's try and get this done real quick. I'm gonna be fully realistic with you guys on based on like what I actually do. Um, things that I leave out sometimes and things that I do do if I've got that bit of extra time with Daniel. Oh my God, it's a bit warm right now. <laughs> Guys, I don't know if you remember, but with Daniel's pregnancy, I was always hot. It's the same with this pregnancy, I'm always hot. So first thing that I always start with um, is I usually moisturize and I've already done that. Um, and first thing in terms of my makeup, I will, I'm currently using the IT Cosmetics um, foundation. Right, so it is actually amazing. If you've got really dry skin or you've got eczema or dermatitis, something like that, anything like that, any kind of skin condition, this is a really good brand to use. It's almost done, like I've used it a lot. Um, it's really smooth on the skin, it's really hydrating. Um, and I'm pretty sure the guy that made this made it because his wife has eczema or dermatitis. So he made it specific for people with skin conditions. Squirt a little bit on my hand. I don't use much at all. I don't like to put too much foundation on my face. So I will get my beauty blender. And honestly, I'm gonna be completely honest. <laughs> Sometimes I'm so rushed, I don't even dampen it. So I use it dry. Um, I'm gonna use it dry today because I literally, I know that it's gonna wake up in a minute. So I'll just dump that there. And then I'll just put it all over my face. I can probably get a mirror so I can see what I'm doing. One second, that's bad. I can see what I'm doing. I've got a mirror. <laughs> just dab that everywhere. Mainly in the spots where I'm red. Um, yeah. If I'm a little bit red, more red than usual, I will use a bit more. I've been, I went, to, I went to the beach over the weekend, so I'm really burnt. It's calmed down now, but it was so much worse before. Oh my God. Actually, I'm just using a little less bit. It was pretty well. Like, I'd say it's like, medium coverage, but yeah, I don't really like that full coverage anyway. So I really like this one. It's so nice, so smooth. After my foundation, I will go in with my bronzer. I have not changed my bronzer ever since pre-pregnancy, ever since I think when I first got married, the Tarte, and I think this is the universal one. Yeah, it's universal color. It's called Park Avenue Princess, Park Ave Princess. Dab into that and go straight in to my cheekbones. Up, girls, remember, always go up. That's what I've learned from all those makeup influencers. <laughs> always go up because it heightens your cheekbones. Like when you do bronzer, I feel like this side, right? This side, I'm always, I always manage to make it look good. Well, I think, I think so. But this side, I don't know, and I always look so funny. It looks so like blotchy every time. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have a side that looks better than the other, but yeah, that one's definitely my better side. Sometimes I will use like a loose powder to powder myself up if it's like on a warmer day or something like that. But today it's kind of gloomy, not too warm outside. So I'm not gonna put any on. Firstly, because I don't have much time. Secondly, because of the weather. <laughs> Thirdly, it's already kind of dry weather at the moment. So it, it will make my skin a little bit more dry. That's just my skin. I will skip that and then I will go into, what do I go into next? I go into mascara. Curl my eyelashes. Always do this, I always curl my eyelashes. Oh God, he's woken up. He's waking up, y'all. Need to finish this quickly. This is the reality of having children. 
mascara that I'm using, by the way, is a Revlon Sophie's. I randomly picked this up and it was, it's really good. I really like it. What do you guys think? I like it. <laughs> I don't always put concealer on. I'll put concealer on if I look extra tired or um, I'm going somewhere a little bit more fancy, <laughs> like, you know, out to lunch or something, you know? Um, and then after that's done, I was meant to put eyeliner on before, but I'm feeling flustered because of Daniel. Um, but I don't always put eyeliner on now, liquid liner. Before, I would never walk out, like if I had makeup on, I'd never walk out with my liquid liner on when I have my face on. Um, but now, it's just honestly, it just like depends on my time. So look, Daniel's waking up right now, but I feel like I'll just quickly do a little bit just for the sake of this video. That's all I'm doing. Um, I don't know if this was the same eyeliner that I was using back when I did my last video, but this is an eyeliner that I just keep rebuying because it's so good. Um, it's the Maybelline Master Precise All Day. So good. I will go in with some blush. I love this blush. This blush is my favorite blush. You only need to use a minimal amount and the colors are beautiful. And this is like just the most beautiful red blush red so nice it's like a pinky pinky red you know oh, look at that one just so so you know and i will put some kind of lip gloss on or nothing <laughs> i'm getting it real with you all and that is all that i do for my mommy makeup routine <laughs> my eyelashes need a bit more like they're not standing out so much because i'm being so quick at the end while everything while everything is dried i'll just do one more layer of mascara and that'll just give a bit of a lift to my eyelashes and i think that's all i do pretty sure that's all i do <laughs> But yeah, so let me know what you guys think and if you're using any of the products that I'm using at the moment. Um, the main one, honestly, that I am obsessed with at the moment is this foundation, the It Cosmetics Foundation. It is so good, like so good. Um, thank you so much for watching my video. I will have more videos coming up, more about my mummy lifestyle, more about my pregnancy. I'm hoping to shoot more vlogs as well of like us going out as a family and things like that. So let me know what you guys want to see. Um, and yeah, hopefully that'll be upcoming. Thanks so much for watching my video guys. Bye.